Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Fate. That's just the name of the game, Fate. I'm in Dungeon Master Darius. I did up the resolution again. Uh, hopefully it should look all fantastical. But last we left off, we were on a quest to find some boots. We failed that quest. So we moved on through the dungeon. Yeah, it turns out that you can... Automatic, uh, you can turn up and down the... Who's a Medusa settings? Yes, the Who's a Medusa settings. But... Uh, when you first open the game... Oh, hello. When you first open the game, and it's like that, then you just want to... Swap, swap out the settings, and bam! It'll fix the map, relatively speaking. Hello? I'm here for some boots, I think? I forget what I'm here for. I'm not here for any more white quality gear, unless I accidentally pick it up. Cause that shit's gonna be maddening. Ah, we'll take gel. We must be close to the enemy. The main big bad of this particular area. Take this crate and barrels. Yeah, in case anyone thinks that, you know, there might be some different layouts of this area, or this game in general, no. You're going through a dungeon. Archer's cap. Don't need. It ain't purple. I don't want it. Ah, these are where the gels in question. I'd say ow, but I'm not sure that really hurts that all that much. He says, being in moderate amount of pain. Rugzabow! Oh, he can't say so and so. I thought I was dying. The quest is completed. We received the thing. Receive the thing. And I wish there was a thing to make it so as it automatically shows the items. But I guess that could be a little bit annoying if you're trying to like look around a dungeon for any loot or bosses or whatnot in particular. Stabity. You are fortified. I didn't need to use that. Probably shouldn't have. Ah, well. Auntie, stop barking at the random monsters that aren't doing anything to you. Of course, the monsters in this aren't as bad as they could be. Like in, uh... Incredible Adventures of Anna Helsing. Yet. They're not that bad. Yet. I should clarify. Because this game will ramp up in difficulty. One of the reasons why I never beat it is because I think around level 10, I want to say? Uh, I just never got the equipment I needed. I don't know whether or not I needed to essentially just fish some more. Or if I just needed some relatively better equipment. Please just... Thank you. There we go. A weapons rack with a new pole arm. I'm not regretting that purchase. Mildly regretting the existing, though. All right, we got a little bit of loot over here. A bit of a ways to go. Nope, that was it. Oh. Thank you, Monty. For saving my keister again. Ah, them traps. 
But that's the way down. Retrieve the hardened Drake Amulet of Dexterity from level 3. I really hope it's not something I have to fish up, because that'll be RNG hell. Eh, balls. Please be carrying that up. Oh, alright. Please just grant me this. Right, any quests that don't require me to kill something, to pick up something, uh, can go to hell at this point. Because it says right up there, level 3. Level 3. Where, oh where the hell could you freaking be? Oh where, oh where did you go? I don't want to be here forever, so please, just show me where you are. Did that rhyme? No. Do I care? No. Oh, that was... yeah. Heck in hell! Alright, guess I'm no longer doing retrieve item quests unless the item to be retrieved is... On a monster. Unless it's over here somewhere. Nope. Irked. Irked, I say. I really hope it's not a fishing thing. Maybe it is. Well, shit. You step into the portal. Step into the portal. I kind of wish that they had an equivalency of Deckard Cain when it comes to some of this. What I mean by that is I have one, two, three. F I have four items to identify. And yet, um, A good how about you? Wanderer. Can you just now? Yeah, selling that. Impossible. Shocking pole axe of strength. Two-handed. Okay, there are two-handed weapons. I'm an idiot. Five to eighteen damage with five electrical damage. Eh. I've already started down the path of two-weapon fighting, sadly. So, uh much as it pains me. Keep going down that path, even if I find some really gnarly, cool-looking weapons. Might as well turn in the quest we just got. Hello. <laughs> Scream, <laughs> Scream Eater's Novice's Mage's Sash of Protection Retrieved. Requires 34 magic, but if I could use it, 1% life stolen per hit. Animation Club Increase. Right, that's why I bought the spell bought that spell in the I first place. Your notoriety has grown. Ha I'm smart. I didn't level up this, but I shall level up this. Uh let's do charm. And then you wield. Surely that's not going to bite me in the ass later on, when I eventually need to get rid of my spear. I would love to just buy some better armor and equipment at this point. Part of me is thinking, maybe, down the line, like, episode 5 or such, I'll go back into the idea of, hey, why don't I do some fishing for an episode. 
Or like 30 minutes, I don't know. You're level 5. Anything? I have no clue where the actual... Level 6, sir. Please, I beg of you. I don't necessarily need to do these quests. A fine day. Okay. There are tales of a nocturne fungus called Baranza, who roams around the fifth level of the dungeon. I'm sure it's, I'm, I'd sure sleep better if nocturne fungus was dead. Gilded jeweled pendant of the tortoise. You have received a quest. Well, I guess we're done with level three. Wait, level five, level four. Okay, we do have a level four. Whew. Everything here is a bargain. You mark my words. Uh, I really need to start doing more damage. That'll do the trick. Oh, that'll do the trick real good. You're gonna have that shitty spear. I got next. You step into the portal. Do, 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 do. Oh, darn it! I'll use the portal. Why not? You step into the portal. Uh, the very, the very laws of magic and whatnot are very confused at the moment. Going like, wait. Didn't you just, sir? Cease. And I'm like, no, no. I I just want to grab my fishing rod. Do I need to? Nah. Do I want to? Hell yes. Yes, I do. I want to see what treasures lie within the dungeon. As soon as it, you know, pops. I really want a different hat. Not that the effects of my current hat are bad. I just want a different one. Because that looks silly. Wow, fingerling archer. Oh, come on, I very much did that on time, and you know it, game. You know it. Don't you lie to me. Come on. Anytime now. I can't keep staring at the screen, game. Hurt my eye. Any time now. See, this is the dangers of these things. They'll keep you waiting. Anytime now, game. Seriously. Also, I love how the animation for the frost is still on my hand. From my, um, sword. Axe, rather. Come on, at least one more thing. Ew, you tease. I nearly missed that. One more go. And damn it. I was doing that thing where it hurts again. No particularly good reason, just decides, hey, I'm gonna hurt and tear up.
My glasses might just be old. I'm not sure. Uh, what do we get? Fingling better. All right, down to the next floor. Part of me is really glad that I did do the identify thing. Uh, part of me knows, though, that I'm gonna plain old plum forget that I got identify. Yeah, break your shit. Woo! Loot. Oh, a frosted bow. I was about to say, did I not pick that up? Yeah, more magic items are going to be prevalent. Prevalent? They're going to exist. Oh my Nelly. Oh my gosh, my golly. You are refreshed. Oh. Oh hey! Yeah, I forgot that you guys can exist down here. Yeah, there sometimes there's just plain old uh sellers. Emergence. Hmm, group heal. That's not a terrible idea. Especially if I do... If I do decide to go into... Um... Defense magic. But I think the defense magic left the building as soon as I sold that spear. Sorry, I had to rub my eyes for like five minutes just to... Stop them from hurting, strangely enough. Ooh, how dare. How dare you. I want that, and you know it, game. One second. Identify. Oh, hello. There we go. Yeah. It's not bad. Well, I'm gonna sell it. Oh, God damn it. Ah. He's trying to murder me while I'm trying to make money. Game. Oh, that's an iguana of some sort. Sorry, basilisks. They're a thing. Do wielding skill increase? This one increases my strength, so nah. At these prices, it's practically steep. Makes me wonder how the hell he got them while I was down here. Game. This is a charm spell. Yeah, this is a charm spell. This will summon a magical cursed sword to aid the caster. That's not a terrible idea. Not a terrible idea at all. Only because I'm like, huh. More companions to murder things with would be great. Let's uh, let's explore this area first, though. I'm I'm just gonna forever be in yesness when it comes to that goddamn Yes, the goddamn totally makes centaur. Now I'm gonna be constantly going just yes when it comes to my luck when it came to that axe that I picked up. Was it worth a lot? Yes. Is it paying out in spades? I believe so, so far. As your long staff, why not? Don't know if that was a forest imp or something else giggling like a fiend. It sure did, game. I kind of assumed that when the uh, game was like, hey, trapped. I'm like, yes, thank you. I would have never known. Let's see. Just up in my strength again. No biggie. Ow, forest bow. 
You have sprung the trap. Cease. Cease with the traps. What am I looking for down here? Fourth level. Oh no, fourth level didn't have a quest for me. I think it was fourth and or fifth and sixth. Now there is one on fourth. Bleh. Do 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 do. Yeah, that that twenty, f that uh, some. That damage is good. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. Murder. Ah yes, small chest worth fourteen gold. That was worth walking down that pathway. You don't say. Oh yeah. God damn it. I'm trying to say, some of the layouts of these dungeons just drive me a little nuts. Oh, look at this place. How many dead ends is this? Too many. Now I gotta run all the way back, the other way. R. Make things easier on me. Oh, hello. Yo, Biggie, you're red. They're called death caps for a reason. Oh. Oh, he slowed me down. And he had some pretty decent resistance. You have completed the quest. Gold's disc, superior light axe. I do remember that the superior stuff sells for pretty good. That's about most of what I remember about that. Do. Do 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 Hey, tunnel crawler, you're a new one. You come up from the depths of hell to say hey, hello, hi. Did I need to murder that last guy? Probably not. Um. Yeah, say hey, hello, hi to the merchant one more time. Sell a bunch of stuff if we need be. Theoretically, I don't even really need the... Um... Yep. That thing. The spell could not be completed. Oh, that requires an identification level of 40. That's way above my pay grade. That's why we grab these scrolls. Superior small. Oh, the superior stuff is listed with the star. Okay. Uh, let's see. No. No, I don't think I need that. So I'll just sell it. No, I won't just sell it. It's part of a quest. Might as well do right by that dude by giving him the stuff that he asked me to get. We'll buy a couple of potions, though. Don't think that there's anything else I need off of you. That would be a pretty cool weapon. Vitality, attack, strength, and dexterity bonuses? Yes. Oh, well. Um, I guess we'll go up to the stairs and then use the portal you step into the portal uh, you know I would worry about um, builds and whatnot in this game if it weren't for the fact that I'm pretty sure that 
since everything is basically RNG. Nah. Uh, here's your reward. Fame, gold, experience points of the crossbow of life. Yep. Crossbow of life. That's totally useful for me. Bull Pike's Heavy Soft Gloves of Warriors. On the seventh level. Wait. Nope. That's just an item. I've been having problem with item quests, so no. I don't know what's wrong with my item quests. I don't know if I need to, like, jump into a lake to fulfill some of them. But no. Well met. Flame Scratcher's superior heavy chains has been a fire family heard that an imp shaman named Abantha Abantza has them on the sixth level. Give you the salt ghoul crushers novices ring ruby ring of strength. You have received a quest. So that's two quests on the sixth level so far. How about you? Welcome, friend! Toothbiters get the lands of the fox. Wereboar named Headcutter. You have received a on the sixth level. That'll be a fun time, won't it? Good day to you. Good day to you. Let's see, Hamburg Crust. Nah. <laughs> Just barely looked at it and went, no, don't need. Next. I guess I could put away the um, fishing pole. Bow. Ooh, excuse me. Yawning. That's what happens when it's freaking. I don't even know what time it is. Ah, uh, what is life without a little risk? I could happily buy some of this stuff, but I. I'm eyeing the axe and going, yes, please, give it to me. This is not going to be worth it. This is not going to be worth it. It was worth it. Anyone like, man, you're just wasting your money. Remember that I can easily get a shitload of money simply by going fishing for a while. Look at the size of this axe. Look at it. It's hilariously sized. I like to call this size hilarity. Alright, we'll quickly deposit... Uh... The thing. God, that is loud music. God. Attack bonus and lifesteal is just great. It's a slow weapon, but... It'll get the job done, I think. So everything I need to do now is on the 6th level of the dungeon. See if we can't do one or two things before calling it an episode. It's all item retrieving quests and slaying monsters, so... There's a boon. Oh, goody. Yep, that's... The hell of a dead end there, game. You have been poisoned. I sure have. Poison is slow, but at the same time can be rather painful. So it makes me rather grateful that I had grabbed myself the uh, thing. Yes. Uh, life stealing axe. And it is 1% life steal, but you know, life steal can uh, get rather beneficial. Not having to worry that much about potions, for example. Or healing charms, I guess. The damage is just nice. Ugh. 
I do like how this game does not restrict you using an item based on your character's level necessarily, just by the items that you have equipped. Ooh, cracked jade. Nice. Your stamina is low. Er, okay, not the items are encrypted. I know what I mean. Um, the requirements of your item. You have completed a quest. Yes, I have. Money. Might as well heal a little bit. Oh, I see a purple glowing in there. Oh. That's trap, ain't it? Nope. I was kind of hoping it was another dude I needed to murder. Earn stuff. Ooh. Okay. Yes, I will. These are magical anvils. You can put shit on them and they will randomly be enchanted. Sometimes. They are sometimes randomly enchanted. Hello. Will you tempt fate? A read from the ancient texts. Fate smiles upon you. Yes. I needed more dexterity, anywho, just in case I need to do a lot more slashy slashy hurdy hurdy. Man, I was hoping for at least one more of the boss, one more of the boss dudes. But here's where I shall call an episode. When we return, further delving into dungeons, more finding of monsters, and possibly spending too much money on an item that I'm probably going to sell in like two or three levels. Thank you everyone so very much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying this series as much as I'm enjoying playing it. And as always, I hope to see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers.